Good morning, my name is Haley and I'm a zookeeper at Safari Niagara. Today I would like you to accompany me on my morning check and breakfast feed with the meerkats. While en route to the meerkat exhibit, I also observe the park for signs of wildlife or concerns with other animals in my travel. As a team, we secure the park prior to opening each and every morning, visiting each and every animal in the collection. Once I arrive at the reptile house, my first task is to do a complete perimeter check of the building. This ensures all specimens are present and secure prior to me entering the building. The circle check allows me to examine the animal holding for any abnormalities with both the animals present or the enclosure integrity. Most importantly, it ensures once I enter the building, all animals are in their separate holding and the area is safe for me to enter. All viewing is done from the outside of this exhi exhibit, another reason that morning check is so important. To the left is the outside meerkat exhibit. This is where we will start this morning. Notice all the ground tunnels they have built. Meerkats are always digging. That's why they possess special adaptations to help them burrow. Their eyes have a clear protective membrane that shields them from the dirt while digging. Their ears also close tightly to keep the dirt out. The building has signage for PPE, personal protective equipment. There is a risk for the animals in our care. Masks, gloves, and foot baths are daily protocol for all the zookeepers at Safari Niagara. The foot bath ensures I am not transferring anything from other areas in the park into this building. Once I am confident all animals are secure and healthy, I make a radio call to my manager, letting her know the area is clear, and briefly review any notes left by my colleagues from the previous day. See that guy standing up? This is generally referred to as the sentry or watch guard position. This guy is looking out for the others in the event a predator is approaching. Today for breakfast, carrots, blueberries, and superworms are on the menu. If I scatter the food, it has two objectives. One is to stimulate natural foraging, and two, it allows all the meerkats to have a fair chance at all of the items I have brought them. Notice how the superworms are a favorite this morning? I generally will use this time to get a better look at all the meerkats, ensuring mobility is good, aggression is absent, and the mob, the term used to describe a group of meerkats, are all getting along and don't have any health issues. I hope you enjoyed Breakfast with the Meerkats.